Hey, Scott, I was just wondering, did you order that bluestone for that job? Um, I don't remember that. Oh, I sent you a uh, group text a while back uh, concerning this, and I just didn't know if you still had that. I don't leave messages for that long. So what you guys just saw was a failure of communication between sales and between operations. And so what we want to dive into today is dive into a little bit more on the communications and what we can do to help. It's not just the hardscape business, it's not just a sales business, it's many businesses out there that fail in their communications between employment. Microsoft Teams is a platform that works with other platforms, allowing you to add um, additional things like Excel spreadsheets. This is a great uh, platform that we've actually moved uh, from Slack to Microsoft Teams due to the capabilities of it. Right here we have a project uh, called Josh Jones and so what we would do is we'd be able to have our project name here and you can see here underneath just general that anything needed um, or example like we're excited to get the project started given the project date um, but then we also have things like you can add in documents uh, if we look underneath this project checklist, this is a great and helpful way as you're working through a project to be able to keep track of what's been accomplished, what hasn't. So you can go through and you can check these items off. You can choose their priority as well as the person that it's assigned to or the user that it's assigned to. So we got different things, you know, if you need to Make sure that the grill island is getting installed, the final inspection, low voltage lighting. All these uh, things would be great examples of items to be added into this checklist to make sure that the project is getting uh, accomplished and completed properly. We look here at inventory. So you'd be able to, again, place inventory or make reminders or notes. Um, for example, we need an all-rounder for this project. Um, and we can see here that Scott has been able to comment back on that, that it's already been ordered. Uh, project photo footage. So this is great because any of the video, the audio, anything that shows up in here will not be distorted or um, uploaded at, at a lower quality. So this is great for your project photos, your social media, being able to keep track of all that on this specific project. And we're looking here at project managers and these would all just be great tabs that would be able to be added into uh, this specific customer. Um, examples too like sales so obviously your sales are going to have to make communications and um, so Tay being a, uh, a salesman would uh, be able to write in here that the customer called want to change something and then that communication can be made. So even if someone is out or out of the office, they come in the next day, they'll be able to see this communication. And this, just like Slack, Microsoft Teams is also another platform that can be used on a mobile phone or anything like that, download from the App Store. So now you guys have been able to join us on this video as we went through the overview of Microsoft Teams. You can see it's a great program to implement into a hardscape company or any other company. But the capabilities and being able to have that communication between the sales team and those that are working out in the field or those that are managing the projects is super huge and we want to help make your company successful. So I hope that this video was a good one for you and thanks for joining us.